All right, let's see which are going to be the teams from part two to face the champions of part one. Starting with... Oh, Porto, all right. Champions of the Primera Liga 2018. And they have Iker Casillas. Group D. Group D. Are you kidding me? Locomotive. Trust me, any club, any team will want Locomotive Moscow. No offense, Locomotive Moscow. Who's next? Roma. Roma. <sighs> Look. Roma sell, sold Raja and Allison. So. I don't see Roma repeating a semi final like last year. Alright, for them, what is Roma's future? Group G. Oh no! They got the top one! Real Madrid! It won't be easy at all against the... Uh, Look, I know there's no Ronaldo, but Benzema, Europe, Bale, Isco... Times mm. of the trophy. Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Kaka, who's next? Manchester United! Okay, I know things are not going very well. They had the worst start in 26 years. It's gonna... You gotta be kidding me, Forlan. After everything they did for you, Manchester you choose. Will play against Good Juventus. Juventus. So Juventus and, uh, Manchester well, United, uh, I gotta be honest. Uh, I know Ronaldo's in Juventus, for sure. but sure in like I said, without Iguain and Buffon, Manchester. Juventus can, will not reach the finals or even win really it. So. Manchester United has a chance. Who's next? Borussia Dortmund. Borussia Dortmund. Borussia Dortmund. Borussia Dortmund's gonna be with Atletico Madrid. Eight. So, Group A for Borussia Dortmund uh, will uh, take uh, Borussia Dortmund okay. to Madrid. It's going to be an awesome match, the, uh, that's true. Metropolitano Stadium. Let the Comandria and Borussia Dortmund will advance the to the next round. Well, then let's see First who's going to be in part 3 and part 4 of that group. Two. Shakhtar Donetsk, alright. Can they reach round 16 like last year? Or can they make it to the quarterfinals like in the Champions League of 2010 to 11? Oh, fantastic. Manchester City and Shakhtar Donetsk. Um, Manchester City has a big advantage. Benfica. Okay. Uh, Benfica has only one possibility, that's Group E, which means that we are not uh, going to draw their group, but the, the team is allocated to Group E together with uh, FC Bayern Munich. Well, you know, like I always say, it's an honor to play against a powerful team. Bayern Munich, Benfica, Benfica against Bayern Munich. Napoli. Napoli. And, uh, All right. Coached by uh, Carlo Ancelotti, Carlo Ancelotti will be looking to win Napoli. his fourth Champions Napoli League. But I just hope that he doesn't get fired if he loses only one match in the group stage, like last year when he was the coach of Bayern Munich and he was fired of losing against PSG last year's Champions League. So let's see who is Napoli going to face. Oh, the irony! Carlo Ancelotti faced PSG with, as Bayern Munich last year. Now he's facing as Napoli. Well. Although I highly doubt he's gonna get fired if he loses against PSG. Tottenham. Tottenham and Barcelona. Okay, that is one tough group. Well, Tottenham and Barcelona will advance to the next round. Let's see who's in pot three. The first one is. Leon. Alright. So. Which is going to be the group that Lyon will be placed in? Group F. Group F. So Manchester City. Group no. F. Well, okay, Manchester City is going to advance as the first in first place, but this could be a battle between Shakhtar Donetsk and Lyon. Manchester City has the easiest group. CSKA Moscow. CSKA Moscow, the UEFA Cup winners of 2005. CSKA Moscow is going to be with... Group G. Group G. Group G is the group of... There is a possibility. Real Madrid and CSKA Moscow. 
advance into the next round. MC Shalk. Schalke. Well, Schalke reached in second place in the Bundesliga, just 21 points behind the first place Bayern Munich. Schalke is going to be in Group D. Are you kidding me? This could be the chance for any of these three clubs. Lokomotiv Moscow, Porto, Schalke, any of those three could advance to the next round. Valencia. Okay. The one who's going to help Valencia a lot is Denis Chirishev. Denis Chirishev was literally the one who helped Russia in the World Cup 2018. He scored four goals and he and Zuba were the key players for Russia in the World Cup 2018. Valencia is going to be in Group H. Manchester United, Juventus, Valencia. Three strong teams. Uh, it's difficult to predict. PSV Eindhoven, well they have Chucky Lozano, he was perfect in the World Cup and he scored that goal, the winning goal against Germany. So Chucky Lozano is going to help a lot in Eindhoven. Okay, for long you have decided the group that Eindhoven will be is... Group B. Oh no! So B means that Eindhoven... Tottenham, Barcelona... And well, Portugal. if Chuke Lozano could score a goal against Germany and defeat Germany, maybe he could beat Tottenham and Barcelona. Okay, Barcelona and Tottenham are going to advance to the next round. Ajax. Well, two Dutch clubs in the group stage of the Champions League. And of course... Yeah, confident. Bayern Munich, Benfica, Ajax. Um, Bayern Munich is going to advance, but Benfica and Ajax will battle for second place. Monaco. Alright, let's just hope that Falcao is not sold to Real Madrid. And they're going to be... Whoa, that is difficult for Monaco. So, so Atletico de Madrid and Borussia Dortmund will advance to the next round, which wow. means that... Oh no, 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 that is tough. Okay. Out of all the clubs, PSG gets the runners up Liverpool. Well, PSG and Liverpool will advance to the next round. Oh. Oppenheim. Well, they reached third place in the Bundesliga with only 29 points behind the first place by Munich. Uh, it's good to see them back this time in the group stage. Of course, they were in the Champions League last year, losing against eventual runners up Liverpool in the playoff round. Group F. F. So the first group completed this group F. Manchester City has the easiest group. Manchester City is going to go first. Hoffenheim second, Shakhtar Donetsk third, and Lyon fourth. Galatasaray. Mm, Galatasaray. Turkish champions of 2018. Galatasaray will be in group... Group D. Are you kidding me? This is like a group for anyone. Any of those four could advance to the next round. Lokomotiv Moscow, Porto, Schalke, Galatasaray. All right. Uh, Schalke will be first. Uh, Galatasaray will be second. Porto third. And Lokomotiv Moscow fourth. Young boys. Young boys are back in the Champions League after 32 years of absence. Group H. Group H, Manchester United is advancing to the next round. Manchester United first, Juventus second, Valencia third, Young Boys fourth. Red Star Belgrade, the winners of the Champions League of 1991. Red Star Belgrade will be in Group C. together with Paris Saint Germain. Napoli, uh, it's gonna be tough, it's gonna be tough! Alright, PSG first, uh, Liverpool three, second, uh, Napoli uh, third, uh, Red Star Belgrade fourth. Alright, Club Bruges. Bruges goes into group 
Group A. Atletico Madrid, you are lucky. Atletico Madrid first, Borussia Dortmund second, Monaco third, and Club Brugge fourth. Victoria Pilsen, they qualify directly to the group stage. Group G. Group G. Real Madrid, you are so lucky. You're so lucky. First Real Madrid, CSK Moscow second, Roma third, and Victoria Pilsen fourth. Oh, Inter Milan. Good to see you back after seven years of absence. You got Raja, Icardi, Brozovic, Perisic, and you get Group B. I'm going to take a risk. Barcelona first, Inter Milan second, Tottenham third, and Eindhoven fourth. I got this. Champions of the Greek Super League. Bayern Munich first, Ajax second, Benfica third, Ajax Athens fourth. And well, that has been it. That is it. Those are the group stage of the draw for the Champions League 2018 to 19. Let's see what's going to happen. And that has been my reaction thank you very much i hope you enjoyed it and i will see you next time see ya